Well, I'm excited. I think things are coming along well with the wide receivers. I'm really pleased with our senior receivers and their leadership that they're providing. Uh, Ty Kurt and Mike Scholar are doing a great job bringing the young guys along, showing them the Lobo way. I'm pleased with the progress of the young guys. Uh, Lamar and Dion, those guys are, are semi-veterans, and they're stepping up the pace a little bit, doing a great job, bring a wealth of speed to the, to the receiver core, and they also bring a lot of depth. We have some young guys, Donnie Duncan and, and um, Daniel Adams, who have uh, progressed tremendously throughout the camp, and uh, they should be, an impact, be impact players for us as well. You can see guys like Daniel, uh, Daniel Adams and Donnie Duncan, who both the freshmen, and Donnie's had the luxury of being here for spring football. Uh, but to see their growth in the system, um, you know, this summer was great for those two guys. The fact that they're able to get here and, and, and go through summer school and, and do some of the voluntary workouts where uh, some of the veteran guys have been able to help them along. You know, for us to hit the ground running with those guys and to see how much they were able to, to uh, really learn over the course of the summer has helped their progress this fall. It's great. It's great to have a lot of threats out there, so uh, everyone's going to have a chance to get the ball. If someone's going to uh, be uh, double teaming Dion, me or Flash will be open. Uh, just like you need, it's going to flash, flash, and Dion or me are open. They're going to double team me, Flash or Dion's going to be open. So it's great to have uh, two other uh, outstanding wideouts uh, playing with. It uh, seems like yesterday, Marcus Smith and Travis Brown took me under their wing, and this year I'm doing the same thing they did to me. Uh, Donnie Duncan and Daniel Adams. You know, I'm trying to help them and provide them with help whenever they need it. And uh, I'm there for everybody in the room, so. The, the tight ends are becoming more of the family type for the, the offense and we're getting more plays, more blocking, and uh, we're in a little bit of the off position now. And we get to go across the field a little bit more and uh, we're just trying to be more versatile for the offense. And the pass completed the end zone to the tight end number 97, Lucas Reed. So, uh, it's going to be exciting times for uh, Lobo football.